back so strong. It was awesome, that. Yeah. Anyway, guys, Go, it's sir. on. It's on, man. Game 8 on the KGB versus POC. It's going to be Rooster version 3. And let's take a look at the civilizations first. I'm right now on the point of view of red player. That's POZ Tammy. He went for hunts. And then we have Kyo with millions here. Vikings for rats and Mongols for tsunami. So no Saracens, no Japanese, as we mentioned before. Uh, the uh, KGB team here is going to go with Ra. That's a Venom for millions as well. Vikings, Hunt, Mongols, so pretty much mirrored, right, Martin? Pretty much the same civilizations uh, by um, by both teams. And um, this is something I like to see. Uh, I mean, it's worse for the players, but better for us when uh, players actually use the in-game chat so we can actually see what are they thinking, what kind of strategies are they planning. So uh, I guess it's not too good for the players themselves, but good for us casters because we know what they are thinking. Okay, uh, right now I'm on the point of view here from um, red players that just told that's Hunt. And uh, looking at it, looks like uh, he doesn't have too much water here, as you can see. He has a bit of a blocked passage here to the center of the map. Um, he does have one deep fish here, so probably uh, he will still go um, front dog. I don't know, we will have to see. We'll have to wait and see. Uh, because Mongols, uh, sorry, hunts, usually expect hunts to be the one of the saves uh, which goes for a fast crush. If not all of them, uh, hunts for sure will be one of them. Let's uh, see how the teams are uh, distributed here. We have um, to the left side, kind of the left upper side from red player, we have here Rats. He will be the Vikings player. And a good thing for him, it looks like uh, he's not too far away here from the center of the map. As you can see, very nice fish on his shore as well. So good thing for him. I uh, would assume Rats will go for a dock here at the front and not here. Uh, this could confuse him a little bit actually, Martin, don't you think? Because just uh, the upper side of his town center, he has water. Uh, but that's not the middle. Uh, I mean, I would suppose these guys are all the map. They, they, but, yeah. they're, they're not going to get confused now. They're in the map they're playing, so that's yeah. that's the one good thing. The first map was just map packs, so it could have been anything. Now they know exactly what map they're on. Yeah, well, you, you would assume they have prepared this and they know exactly how the map looks like. And as uh, you. Go ahead. At this at this level, they definitely know what this map looks yeah, like. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I would assume so. I would assume so, indeed. <laughs> okay, guys. As you can see, in case you don't know this map very well, there is um, passage uh, through land th uh, between all the players on this map. As you can see here, this path here around the shoreline, it's all uh, pretty much open to every player. But as you can see, it's a narrow passage, so it's easily wallable in case they uh, they choose to do it. So I'm gonna, as you just could see here, I was on the point of view of Rats, and Rats is gonna be facing a uh, great player, that's Mongols, that's Stark, also known as a Black Bolt, as you can see here. He has a, here a little bit of a uh, hurt villager, but looks like he's doing good on his economy, already bringing in the second war as Mongols, of course, you want to have it as fast as possible, uh, to make sure you can have a very fast, fast uptime. He's already sending a villager here uh, to make a dock. Mm, I'm not, I don't like where he's going with this villager, no, it's probably gonna go through the right spot. Hopefully he's not going to put a, um, a dock here because I don't think that's where he wants it. No, just uh, turned around and it's going to make a bar uh, sorry, a dock in here. And he, as you can see, he brings a scout because this villager has no loom. So of course he needs to bring the scout oh, to yes. make sure this villager won't be attacked by wolves. And in case it does get attacked by wolves, uh, he can just protect it with, with a scout. And um, keep keeping a look on the KGB team now, as we just uh, said. Uh, yes, go it ahead. looks it looks like Rats is going to be docking outside, and everyone else is going to dock the inside. Yeah, that's what I was kind of fearing before, right? Um, yeah, you could see. I watched where Rats started to build his house, and I thought he's going to dock outside. But I think Goku, and, sorry, Stark, might dock outside and the middle. Let's By see the look of where he's going, he's, yeah, he's docking the outside corner, look. And he's also got a Vil walk into the middle, and that Vil's going to wall. Yeah, yeah, there you go. He's docking the, the back as well, but so um, it's not really necessarily going to be um, a boom kind of play, uh, because both players are so close to each other, so it's probably still going to be a fast uh, up feudal time for both yeah, players. Yeah, but it's, right? better, it's, it's better for POZ now that Stark has docked the outside, otherwise you'd have... You'd have rats on the outside all on his own, and, and the inside, POZ, would be 3v4. Yeah. So it's it's the best thing that could have happened there to rats that, that Stark tried to dock outside as well. I agree, uh, Reese. It's going to be, uh, looks like it's going to be a bit of a 1v1 here between a Black Bolt, that's Stark, and a POZ rats here. And probably in the middle of the map, all the other players will make a dock in there. As uh, just uh, Mem was saying, 
Looks like Goku lost yeah. a villager, bad for him. But I still want to rotate a little bit between the players. The pocket for Black Bolt is gonna be Hassan, KGB Dogma, with Hans here. Uh, where did he make his dog? I can't see a dog so far from Hassan here. Uh, it looks like he's still wandering a little. Oh yeah, there it is. It's on the middle as well. So Hassan is gonna go for the middle. Um, the other side of the KGB team will feature oh. Teal player that's Ra. That's KGB. There's a big fight. There's a big fight right on Rats' base by his lumber camp. Look. Yeah, I, I can Villagers. see it. Villagers. And Villager scouts. Looks like Tammy just lost his scout here and uh, Black Bolt needs to go back as he wanted to have a very um, very ambitious wall there, Martin, right? He's probably he's really yeah. nosy at the, uh, wall at the nose of uh, rats there. That's a very ambitious wall from, uh, from KJV uh, Black Bolt there. I would assume he would make a little bit of a shorter wall. Hassan, ooh, Hassan moved his scout just in time. Um, but, but I think Stark might. Stark's gonna lose that vill. I don't think he's gonna get rid, get that vill safe now. No, 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 no. The scout is that there. That vill's going down. Uh, yeah. yeah, but I think the scout will be too late because there's a scout and a vill there as well. Well, looks like uh, Tammy nice. chooses to take the scout. Um, the scout on very low oh. HP. Um, Hassan also there. Maybe that's gonna save that villager, Martin. I think that's gonna be the savior. But Hassan oh. also on very low HP. So hard to say. Hard to say. Um, no, no. Is he giving you? No, Stark. he's not oh, giving he's up. back again. <laughs> he's not giving up. Oh, he is. He's, I think he can't decide himself. <laughs> uh, yeah, no. Looks like now he's going back, and he will go for a more conservative wall, and not just go fully, uh, fully um, into the nose of rats. Okay. Um, anyway, Tammy um, Stark's almost there, and Tammy's the fastest, but he's a long way behind. Stark is going to be much quicker than rats on the water to field. But obviously, he's Mongols, so Vikings still got a chance of catching up. Yeah, very good. Stark, Stark, Stark's there now. Stark is the first to feel. So let me take a look at the point of view from Rats. Uh, yeah, Rats still on, uh, pretty much on fifty percent, not too much. So uh, he's probably gonna have a hard time here. Does he know that? Oh, uh, he's going. Um, Stark's going transport ship. He's he's gonna he's gonna bluff a crush. He's going one galley and then transport ship, and it looks like he's gonna transport the villagers straight across to Rats. Okay, uh, looks like this is going to be this villager waiting here at the shoreline. Well, that's a very interesting strategy, to be honest. Uh, probably, does he actually know? Does Black Bolt know who is he fighting? Uh, well, he he knows because of yeah, the walls. Yeah, he knows cause because he of the walls, it, yeah. yeah. But he doesn't know where exactly the docks are. He's making a second dock, though, Martin. Um, it's probably just a bluff, you think so? Well, it's just strange. He went, oh, he's cancelled, he's given up. I think he's because he realized that rats were so far, so much later to, to feudal, feudal than him. Yeah, so he can actually fight uh, on feudal with galleys. He's just trying to uh, sniping a few fishing boats here, as you can see. Um, rats needs to micro them away as he's being hit. And he's not uh, just yet uh, has enough units to fight this. Let me go back to Rats' point of view here. And let's see if he's going to be able to actually hold this attack here from uh, Black Bolt, which uh, seems to have been able to kill one of the fishing boats for rats. There we go, already two galleys being popped out. Um, yeah, he really needs to move them further south. I think he just lost his second there. Uh, bad luck or just bad micro, I don't know. He now has one galley out himself and he's probably in time gonna be able to defend this rush here from Black Bolt. Uh, let's take a, a little bit of a look at the middle, Martin. Is something happening on the middle? Yeah, strange one in the middle. You've just got Ami, you got Ding, Ding on his own with um, Goku and Hassan on the middle and then the others have sort of spread partly around the outside ha you can understand why Ra's gone on the outside I'm assuming Ra's just going to be slinging Hassan we will have I haven't checked I haven't checked it but by the way it looks like Ra's playing it looks like he wants to set up the sling and he normally slings Hassan Okay, looking at what's happening here, looks like Rats is still having a hard time here to try and defend from this rush from Stark. Stark is able to f uh, kill the third fishing ship already, and uh, this this means trouble for Rats, which now himself tries to yeah, go around and snipe a few fishing boats. Look I think I think Rats will be absolutely fine though, because he's going to produce from four, and Stark just stopped at making two two docks. Yeah, as and two docks two docks versus the Vikings, he's going to waste his time. Rats will Rats will come on top of Stark at some point. Yeah, but as I just mentioned. Uh, Stark um, did a transport ship here. I don't know if Rats was able to see this. Looks like... No, he was. I think uh, Rats was able to see this. Will he expect the landing? Or maybe he only saw the galleys? That's the question. Uh, no, they land. Uh, they land, says Tom... Uh, POZ Tammy here. Tammy. 
Yeah, so probably one one of them spotted this, and uh, Stark's gonna land here. This I I, I don't know. No, look, uh, Rats is moving a few villagers in, so probably he um he smells or he actually did see the transport ship there at the north. He's doing um um outpost here, but Stark's still moving around somehow. Yeah, he uh probably thought that's not the best place to land, and still even if he lands here, Rats is gonna be able to see where exactly due to this very intelligent outpost just around their base, and uh, yeah, he can see down the archery range here for um for Stark. Let's see how exactly where he react to this. Tam Tammy's done a really, really good job in the middle as well. He's fighting the San Ango and he's keeping he's he's just fighting one at a time and running away until he can fight the other one on their own. He's not he's not letting Hassan and Goku get together. And now Goku's gone back. So he's just left Hassan on his own versus Tammy. It's worked well for POZ in the middle. Okay, so I'm um, just gave, uh, having a little, uh, little snipe here into the w the middle fights. As Martin just said before, it's Goku and Hasa uh, who are fighting both uh, POZ Tammy. It's POZ Tammy alone in the middle, Martin. Yes, he's on his own. He's on his own, so he yeah, will die he's eventually. All on... Yeah, and, and um, Rats, Rats really has a little bit of luck spotting that Stark's transport ship, but he, he stopped it straight away. I hope in now he's going to tell. He's gonna tell Ding that Stark's just gone straight round on the transport ship to land Ding now. So what happened to with him? I'm hoping he told him. They, he got two of them away. Okay, so he, uh, he managed to keep his transport ship and he run him away again. But so he's, he's now gonna land Ding. <laughs> yes, he's running uh, towards Ding now. Now let's hope the team communication is the right one here. And um, Rice has been able to actually warn Ding that a landing is coming uh, in his direction. I don't think I don't think he has because they'd only type in and and. Tammy, sorry, Rats hasn't told Ding anything. Yeah, so would. Ding is Ding is completely oblivious to him being landed. Okay, Rats has a scout here, and this scout has a lot of HP. And uh, oh, like he just saw did it. he see it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He exited. He exited. So it uh, looks uh, like uh, okay. What is Tammy gonna do about this? So he just exited, and now Tammy does no. Uh, he has skirmishers. He has skirmishers waiting for it. As you can see, two archer ranges here from Tammy. Uh, two skirmishers will probably be able to take care of business here, Martin. Um, yeah, and now uh, uh, Rats even coming with uh, with their galleys, killing one of the villagers, and two of the villagers. So a uh, very bad thing here going up for Stark. Lost all the villagers. And um, Stark, and Stark just sticking to those two docks. As we said, he's going to get overpowered by Rats, and he is. He's gonna he's gonna have lost the water, lost his transport, lost his landing, and he's he's like 14 pop behind his teammates. So that's cost Stark. It was a risk. It was a risky attempt when he was fast at the feudal anyway. Yeah, yeah, indeed. Uh, looks like post tsunami here. That's B virus coming in from the outside to help rats finish off everything that uh, Stark still had on land. Um, pretty much expected. The middle is now in control of the KGB team, yes. uh, Martin, which for the first time in the game actually takes the score lead. Um, but are they really winning this game so far? I don't know. Uh, no, I think it's just pop a pop number. Maybe I don't think they win in this game at all. I think I think Stark's gonna end up in trouble. Yeah, I will uh, switch to the point of view of, of Kyo. He was the first one to reach Castle H. Let's see what exactly is he doing. Uh, as you can see, he's only one dock here at the outside, so he's probably not going for any kind of um, any kind of rush on water. So I'm kind of wondering what exactly is he doing. Imperial H. He's clicking up Imperial. Was he slain, Barton? What happened here? He has a castle. I'll check on. I'll check on Slings, you know. Please do. Please do. He's just uh, clicking up to Imperial. He has a castle here. Nobody. Uh, Nobody, nobody is slinging anyone at all. So how the hell is this possible? Uh, that's a 20 minute click Imperial Age, so very, uh, somehow he just did really, really well here. Uh, he's very low on numbers, obviously. Um, he's probably gonna need a sling at some point. I, I can't imagine that he will be able to do much with this low number of population against a uh, castle here from Ra. Um, yeah, but it, it trebuchets. If he just goes trebuchets as soon as he gets up, then he could potentially take down Ra's castle, and that's going to hurt Ra more than, yes. you know, because he obviously he's mayans. Ra wants all his castles. Yeah, let's see so, what exactly is he going to do. Um, and so I like I like the fact Kyo hasn't hasn't just sat in his pocket. He's just gone right, and the first military he's built is right on top of his flank, which is B virus. Yeah, and uh, looks like Tammy hasn't been too passive with his two archery ranges. He's just landed a uh, black bolt here, who's now in big trouble. He's uh, looks like he's uh, only has market and um, and blacksmith at home. I don't see any military buildings apart from a barracks, and he oh, could be in trouble. Oh, he was here. lucky. 
He was lucky he didn't walk straight past all his woodcutters. If you're lucky, he could have sat the other side of those trees. Yeah, he's now going to go all the way around, but that gives uh, Stark, that's Black Bolt, just enough time. time to close uh, his base here. Uh, yeah, a few more Palisades here, and he's totally close. Uh, do keep in mind, it's range units, these archers, so they could still attack from the back. But uh, anyway, it looks like he's moving to Hassan. He's trying to, he's not going to be able to because there's a wall there from Stark. Um, still a very, it's a very, very close game, this. Okay, we're still on the point oh. of view of Kyo here. Go ahead, go ahead. Oh, you know the big, big problem here. I just, I, I don't know why the Dickens I didn't spot it earlier. Goku, Goku has just stayed feudal. He's, he's still in feudal age. So he must be looking at starting to sling and he hasn't yet. But the problem is Goku is the flank and he's going to be up against Mongols and Mayans and the Mayans already Imperial. Uh -huh, let's and all see. you've got is, is one is one Ra castle, Ra is Mayan, so there's no way Ra's going to be able to go forward and stop Trebs. So I'm hoping Keo just goes mass Trebs now. If Keo, Keo goes Treb, 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 they're not going to stop him taking out Goku. Two traps being made up, as you just said. One of them is out already, the second one being made. Uh, yeah, he needs to ask his teammate to delete this wall, that's what he just said. Uh, B-Virus needs to wake up. B-Virus, there you go, he's uh, now deleting these walls. And one trap's gonna start firing at this castle, and what exactly can Ra do? Let me go into his point of view. Um, where is the KGB Venom? He's uh, not too far away from Imperial himself, and if he actually manages to keep his castle alive until he has a few traps of his own, this could be good for him. Uh, he does have no, uh, pretty much no villagers. Uh, he has four villagers. Okay, so he's probably Go gonna be able to uh, keep Goku. repairing it. Ah, uh, no, 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 I don't like this. Goku is gonna full sling now. I, I said when I saw him still feudally, he hadn't slung at all earlier. He's now full sling in Ra, and Ra is his pocket, and Goku's the flank. I don't like this, because because B virus is not slinging at all. B once B virus hits Imperial, as as well as Kyo, there is no way they're gonna stop. No way Goku and Ra are gonna stop B virus and Kyo. No way. Yeah, so the thing I'll is... Stop, I'll stop casting if they do, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, the castle looks like there's nothing which will save it. Uh, that castle is gonna be gone for rather. That's a, a tough a tough thing for a Mayans player who's just now reached Imperial Age, and he doesn't have any other castle, does he? No, he does not. And he also doesn't uh, have enough um, stone to just make another one. Uh, the good thing going good here for KGB Martin is that the middle is on their power, right? As so they had all that awesome fish in the middle just under their control. Ah, this I don't. I wouldn't care if I was POZ. Now I'd say, so what? They're not making galleys. They're not doing anything. Who cares? Okay, so the honestly, Hassan mess... Hassan can fish his ass off. He's not going <laughs> to change this change this game once Goku's hurt. Okay, so uh, the mess walls are real. Look at this, guys. It's a uh, four layers already. A fifth one being made. Uh, pretty much crazy. Yeah, of course, uh, Kyo needs to bring in uh, his archers here to make sure he can stop these villagers from just keep wall and walling. A castle. Just transport well. around. Just just transport. All he got to do is transport around the Goku's base. That's all what his they're doing. Matches. That's what they're doing. Bye or, bye. Um, I see a transport ship there from Tsunami, but it looks like it's full. So some a few um, a few um, plant archers are going to be inside. Oh, he's landing at the falls at the wrong spot though. Yeah, and only one. I mean, why would you transport only one plant archer? Uh, I don't why get just this. one? I don't, no, get, I don't get that either. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's, uh, really, let's go back. You just just wait until B virus comes in as well with his with his Mongols. Once he gets Imperial fully boomed, now. Yeah, oh, so chance. very good thing here for uh, Kyo Martin. Uh, we we missed this before. Kyo has landed has uh, Ra at his base with a few plumed archers, not many. I see only two of them, but that's enough to kill like one, two, three, four, five villagers, maybe six or seven even. So and very, and very nice slow job. the boom. Indeed, indeed. And it, it slows down the boom. Yeah. Awesome, awesome job there. Very nice team play. And now there is um, some more plumbed archers going in on that transport ship. I hope so. It needs to go all the way around because some heavy walls are going on here for Goku. Look at that. Uh, walls yeah, but why you got why why you gotta think Goku's wall, 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 constantly thinking defense, defense, defense. Where is he gonna come from? And all that time he's not concentrating on building his eco to do the full sling because yep. that's what he set up for his full sling. So this is massive advantage to POZ. Massive. I'll, I, I'll honest. I know it's very early game, but KGB are gonna have to really play unbelievable to get back in this game. And it would probably be all around Hassan and potentially Ra, mainly Hassan. And to do something funny here, He's I gonna agree. Going to have to do yeah. something special. Yeah. And hitting hitting Kyo is a perfect move as well. Hassan has landed him and he's building stables in Kyo's base.
Okay, let me that's take a look at that. That's the best, best thing they could do. This is very good. Let me switch into Kyo's point of view. Does he know what's happening to him here? Uh, no, he does not. No, he does not. He has no idea. Uh, Hassan is already on Imperial. It's 100 population. That's very good. And uh, he has all that boom from the fishing in the middle. So he's probably going to have very nice economy uh, right now. I think he's... Has he stood him now? Uh, he missed it by... No, he like hasn't. Tile, uh. Oh, but no, he's no, 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 spot. He now he says it, yeah. He'll, now he spot, says it. he'll spot one, but he hasn't spotted the ones above. He's which Hassan can just run around at. He's and Hassan ob obviously is going to go pals, and if Hassan goes siege and pals, then Keo's in trouble. He's but but B Virus in the meantime could be coming through himself, Imperial Age, with a fully boom Mongol. So Mongols, Keo, yeah. Keo, Keo could defend, and he can just let B Virus go off and attack Goku. Okay, so this is the um, this is not looking too good here for Q at this moment. He needs to cancel this TC. There are galleys there from Goku flying with him. There are already a few knights from uh, uh, Dogma from what is, Hassan as well. What has what has Ding got? Ding come with anything? He sends himself. He has a few carry archers. Yeah, because Ding could come in and protect Kyo. But but honestly, I think B Virus will just continue the push against Goku now instead of Kyo. Okay, Kyo needs to do something at home. He, he can't just uh, let uh, these knights from us uh, destroy him. It's Cavalier by now. But 2 plus 4 armor upgrades, so they are very strong. They won't die easily to just TC fire. Um, something needs to happen here. Someone needs to help Kyo as soon as possible. Or, um, or um, POZ team could be uh, for a rough time here now. Yeah, I think that's the best thing Hazan could have done. He's gone straight across. Forget, forget rats, forget Tammy. Gotta stop Kyo. Yeah, and it uh, looks like they haven't been able to push, uh, to do a lot of progress there on the south uh, onto Goku, who has just been able to mess walls so, so much. Uh, so now it's all on Hassan here to try and do something funny onto the team of POZ. Uh, there's uh, Tammy trying to haul, it's not gonna be on time. No way, sir, that's gonna be Cavaliers on your nose as well. Uh, Cavaliers with plus four and already plus one attack. Uh, yeah, Tammy himself doesn't seem to have a lot of army at his disposal uh, at this moment. He's Still, still a good pop though, isn't he? I mean, all of the POZ team is still very, very good pop compared to the KGB side. KGB at the moment are totally reliant on Hassan, I think. Yeah, uh, you, you can see here how Kyo is now bringing back all this army, all these plumbed archers, not elite. Bear in mind, they are not elite. Um, Hassan is uh, idling a little bit his cavaliers. He's only attacking buildings, not attacking villagers. Um, that's something he um, he should be doing. He should be trying to just kill economy, not concentrate too much on farms or buildings. And that's what he's doing now. Um, still no, not much of a big progress here onto Goku, Martin. So nice job by Goku, to be honest, right? Yeah, yeah, but it's been slow because it was just Trebs. But as now B-Virus got the siege onages. Well, he's got onages at the moment, and he's telling he's telling Kyo to cut the trees. Yeah, look at that. Uh, B-Virus is asking, do you need me? And Kyo, yes, sir, I need you. <laughs> it's not looking very good at my time. Ra, yeah. Ra is pushed. Ra is pushed right up around the other side of the map. He's left Goku to just wall, and Ra's now pushing on rats, Ooh, if you look. Ooh, I'm seeing this now indeed a sneaky attack here from Ra onto player uh, 6 that's Reds. Uh, does Reds have anything to defend this? Ra has a very nice population, 130 uh, population. Uh, Red seems to be very much behind at this point and uh, who could help him? Who could help him? No one could because uh, they are too busy trying to help Kyo. Yeah, B-Virus got to move fast now. He's really, really got to start moving fast. Either start transporting villages around and building, and building between Goku and Ra, or he needs to cut and just get through. Or give up, give up on that front, do the same thing, wall Goku off and go and fight everyone off, off um, Ding and Kyo. Yeah, this is not looking good at all for Rats here. He's gonna lose so much economy. He's uh, right now on 93 population. He has nothing to stop plumed archers, elite plumed archers even. Look at that. And uh, capped rams for now. They're prob probably gonna be very soon siege rams too. Yeah, those villagers are not gonna be able to repair this town center. Uh, this is a slaughter right now on Rats base. He's gonna lose so, so much economy. Someone needs to come and help him. I see Paul Stemmy chasing a few of Cavaliers here from Hassan. Uh, he does have enough, he does have enough, he's still missing a few upgrades. Uh, no, there we go, he, he does have the plus four. Hassan, same, exactly same number of upgrades for both players. Uh, Reds was able to wall this part, so good for him. Uh, Hassan will not have any access to his base, uh, but bear in mind, it's still not looking good at all right, for Reds here. Right, I think they're finally gonna get... They're finally going to get through to Goku now, because the, because B-Virus has gone there with the onagers. Still no siege onagers though, yeah. 
So no siege armor, so he cannot cut this forest just uh, as but of why now. The, the tribes could have cut the trees for him, eh? Yeah, yeah. He did. Uh, he asked Keo to cut the trees. Is it open now? Is it open now? I don't think it is. No. Uh, but uh, still enough range on this mango die to kill that villager who was trying to wall a little bit more in the back. Um, yeah, they desperately need to go in here because uh, for the last I don't know ten minutes the POZ. Why? Why yeah. doesn't he just, he got a transport ship sat there, why doesn't he just send the manga dies around the other side? It'll stop Goku doing absolutely everything. Well, to be terribly honest with you, Goku has been really proactive with his walls. He's walled pretty much all the way around. Uh, so I think that is the only way to get in, to be terribly honest with you. But also, if you look, Goku doing all this work defense non-stop, his, his population is 51. Yeah, it's very, very low, because yeah. He, he hasn't had the time to be doing anything other than trying to defend and protect himself, so they... <laughs> Ding! Oh, it's paladins yeah, now. Yeah, well, okay. I was about to say that. So Ding has now paladins, and uh, bear in mind, I think these paladins are actually enough to tackle this. I think you should just move in and tackle this. I think you would be able yeah. to paladins with already 3 plus 4 armor, really, really strong. Oh, well, not only 3, obviously, you need to keep them all together, Ding, and that's what he's doing. And uh, I think these are these are enough. Paladins are so much stronger than cavaliers. I think um, this is the time to attack Ding. Right, he's gonna get in now. There's no way that B virus is not going to get in. Yeah, Just there's no Goku, stopping him now. Yeah, Goku can't stop that. Is Goku running? Um, I is don't... he running yet with Vils? No, he's not. He hasn't built anywhere else and he hasn't run. Well, it looks like Rai is a risky. more... Uh, yeah, Rai straight to wall to block the passage to his base. So this could actually be really, really dangerous for Goku here. Um, yeah, if you look, if you look, Hassan's had to come down as well. So you've got a Rai walling Goku off. You've got Hassan coming down constantly. It's just going to put, you know, more emphasis then on P.O. ending and taking Ra and Hassan off the top. Yeah, but look look how Ding is playing this, Martin. It's so many paladins there. He's gonna clean all of that. All of that army for Ra is gonna die uh, merciless. Yep. And uh, those few cavaliers from uh, Hassan are not even gonna be able to scratch these paladins. Uh, they're still nope. missing a few attack upgrades, but full HP, Bloodlines is done, full armor. And the Ding yep. is playing amazingly this game. And the huge difference now is B-Virus has finally got into Goku, so they know there's going to be no more sling coming through, they're going to be 3 versus 4, plus they've also got to change all their strategy now to stop to stop B-Virus and Kyo's push into Ra's base, because yeah. Goku's base is going to be gone in, in 5 minutes, Goku will have nothing left in, all his villas would have run to behind Ra and the San. Uh, so is it paused for be... you too? Is the game paused yes. for you? Okay. Yeah, the game's paused. Looks like it's about to continue though. Yeah, there you go. And it was just mentioned before, Goku is running. Uh, he is running. He just, uh, yeah, you need to go around, Goku. Keep moving, sir. Keep moving. Or you might be actually, uh, I, want, I don't want to say the word defeated, but yeah, you need to run to the few villagers. There you go. Um, Asan yeah. is paladins as well, but he... He hasn't got an. He didn't have enough cavalry left. Not nearly make it, enough. Make it worthwhile. Not nearly enough. Yeah. The only thing missing for Ding here is a little bit of siege. He does need siege rams, or he needs uh, his Viking, uh, his Viking flank to do siege rams for him. But they do need some kind of siege to pull off this push here from Ra. Uh, I don't think you need to worry too much at all now, because I think Ra and Hassan are going to be absolutely full time trying to stop Q and B virus at the yeah. bottom. Yeah. And if they if they're not. If they're not full time at the bottom, then this game is lost. Yeah, the KGB Cause... team desperately needs um, Black Ball Stark to go back into the game. He's already more than 30 population. Uh, I, I, I saw a few castles here. There you go. One, two. That's the third, possibly. So they do yes. desperately need him back into the game, uh, back at actively playing this. Keep the girl. Yeah, he's never, he's never going to catch up, though, is he, Stark? Because B Virus has had this huge free boom. So he's he's going to out Mangadai him, and he's also got the siege on just with it. So, Man, but look at this army. This is scary, Martin. This is scary. So many siege, uh, elite Mangadai, siege honors, elite. No, sorry, not elite. Plume darters, as if now. Oh, uh, Ding, uh, Ding just trapped, just trapped Raz, uh, full elite. Ooh, I um, see what happened. Plumes. There. Oh, Aww. he trapped them perfectly. Oh. Ooh. That was a beautiful play by Ding. And Ra tried as much as he could to run away and get from it, but Ding split all his groups into three and threes and fours and trapped him, and he's lost a lot. Ding just playing this awesomely, and the plum archers are gone from Ra, who now has the halberdiers. That's a good thing for him, but still lacking a lot of upgrades. Uh, this halberdiers are not going to be able to scratch those paladins. 
But look at the look at the bottom map through Goku's base. As we said, Goku has got nothing left whatsoever already. Yeah, this is this, uh, this is sort of a highway here for uh, for the POZ team here. It j they still need a few traps though. Uh, they cannot tackle those castles without trebuchets. Ah, uh, they could do a, quite a lot of decent hits with Mongo, Mo <laughs> Mongol <laughs> Siege on it, just mind. Mongol Siege on it, just sit, sit the manga dies around and... Um, uh, Reds needs to delete these walls, delete these walls, man. You, you need to delete these walls, Reds. You're blocking your paladin from your teammates. Uh, but anyway, I don't think there's a chance, at least as if now, for the KGB team to take this fight here. They need to go back, that's a lot of paladins right there from Tammy. And um, yep, yeah, the, uh, the Siege Honors are there, man, and this is a scary sight. Elite Mango Dice plus Siege Honors, oh my god, I, I, whew, yeah. I wouldn't be happy to see they're, that. They are not stopping. There's no way in the world they stop the virus at the bottom. I see a Goku with uh, Cannon Gallons here in the middle, but look at his population. Only 50 population, that's really, really, really low at this point. Taking a look at the back, yeah, Ding is still missing one upgrade, that's true, what about Hassa? Hassa is still missing it too, so they are at the same spot. One castle down for Ding there, finally. They do need the trebuchets to, um, to be able to push here, because with that castle there, they won't be able to do much. Goku has no TCs left, Mem just said, that's pretty funny to be honest. It's well, we funny. knew, well yeah, we knew Goku's town was gonna be gone in five minutes. It was always the risk him being the full sling from that position. He couldn't have done much more, Goku. So looks... The amount of walls and delays, oh, big hits on the manga dice. Yeah, yeah, this is oh, too ambitious. This is that too was, ambitious. Yeah. yeah. There was no need to take that risk. Look at, look at, the, look at the hit points yeah, yeah, left yeah, yeah, on yeah, those yeah. manga dice okay. now. They yeah. might look like a big army, but they're almost all dead. Yeah, that was too that ambitious was right there from B-Virus. Uh, way, way too no ambitious. No need. Yeah. When, there's, when there's five Ebuchets sat behind and all those siege on it, just why risk losing all your manga dice? Elite did that as well. Yeah, uh, Sark was trying to do some nice micro moves here with his uh, Siege Honors. It's really, really hard on the 4v4 though, and when uh, there's so much population involved though. Uh, desperately trying to repair that castle is Hassan. Will he be able to? I don't know. I see at least two. Uh, um, no, only one Trebuchet is fighting in this castle. Uh, Kyo to needs be to focus. To be fair to Hassan and Rado, they haven't given up at all in the Rats' base. They've still tried to get the pressure on attacking while still trying to stop them getting through to Ra's base itself. So. They're really trying all over the map. Yeah, they were able to stall a little bit of the fight there, so Ding wasn't able to do a lot of progress, because bear in mind, he's fighting two armies, uh, but now he does have three castles, so we're gonna see trebuchet from him very soon, I think so. Yeah, and uh, still, um, I wonder what is Kyo doing here. He needs to focus these three trebuchets onto this castle, make sure he gets Yeah, he, he waited. The reason he stopped is because Goku had um, cannon galleons in the water, and the cannon galleons were killing all the trebuchets, so oh, he stopped. Oh, I see, I see. So uh, I'm assuming any time now he'll move forward to take the castles down. Okay, Ding has a lot of paladins, but there are a lot of help of Deers now for Ra. Still missing a lot of upgrades though. Um, I think Ding shouldn't be too afraid of this uh, help of Deers as of now at least. Uh, Ra still needs more armor. The trebuchets! Of trebuchets are blocking the path. They're blocking the path so that Ooh, they are. Stark, Stark could come in now and potentially kill all them trebs and the yeah. Mag dice can't get through. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and Stark missed it. Oh, he's coming in now. He's coming in now. This is gonna be bad. This is gonna be really bad. One shot. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah, and the mango dice cannot range. They don't have enough range. Well, to the fire. castles, the castles down, but they can't get through because the trebs are blocking the path. Both of them are trebs. They're trying. Yeah, they're trying to open the wall now to get some more. Yeah, a uh, little bit of an unfortunate play there, a uh, little bit of miscommunication right there. Uh, it's Stark but Stark's still missing a little bit of Mango Dice there, Martin, I reckon. He's still a little bit yeah, behind B-Virus. Uh, B B B-Virus B -virus has got an awful lot of Mango Dice, and he's waiting for the Siege on just to come up, and then there'll be another huge push into Ra's base, which could be game-changer here now. Next five, five to ten minutes, B-Virus is going to push right into Ra. And then once Ra's lost his base, then I think they, uh, they will probably call GG. Okay, I'm uh, watching now the point of view of Kyo. Looks like Hassan was trying to do uh, some uh, nice little raids here, but uh, Kyo pretty much expecting it. Uh, he has a lot of army at home, was able to pull this off, and uh, Ra is no, no, out of his base, so he uh, looks looks like he's fine for now. Uh, the problem here for Ding is he's still fighting alone. He does need the help of his Viking player, otherwise it doesn't seem like he's gonna get too much lucky fighting two armies right there all by his own. 
B-Virus is risking an awful lot with his idle manga dice standing around shooting walls because you can see Stark's just coming in and shooting and shooting with the siege on it. Just can you see? Yeah, I, I'm right now. I'm. Uh... Oh, he's looking to lose load. Watch a shot. Ooh. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Only he's two, not two. Oh, and again, and again, he's gonna watch this. Watch, watch. <laughs> Oh, but there What is he doing? Oh, he had oh, a good hit again, himself. Yeah, yeah. You did see the hit. Yeah, yeah then again, uh, Stark will see a lot of oh. angle there as well. So lots, lots of Siege Honor just action here. Um, I don't know who took the best out of that. Well, looks like B-Virus is left with only a few Mango dice. So I would say Stark won that fight, actually. He still has all of his Siege Honor just left back there. And only three left for um for um, B-Virus here. They're not... They, virus is not pushing as strong and as fast as I expected him to. And, yeah. and a lot of that, I think, is he's, because he's, he's blocking himself and he's making it very restrictive. Just just sit back with all your siege on and just and smash every one of them walls down. <laughs> yeah, and then you've yeah, got yeah. complete freedom. I totally agree with you. Before He should try to clear these walls before actually trying to push, to do any uh, decent push here toward the base of, um, of Ra. And uh, this is the problem. Uh, Stark still has so many Siege Honor just left. Um, B-Virus either needs to micro this really, really nicely, or he needs to bring Trevor Sage or Siege Honor just of his own very, very soon. Or he won't be able to push this. Ooh, this could be a bad shot into B-Virus. Yeah, B-Virus is not focusing on this well, part of the map. I mean, I'm sorry, I'm on B-Virus's point of view now. Just look at the economy. Just have a look at B-Virus's economy. Well, and let me see. What, and he's 140 pop. Oh my god, he's, oh my god, look at that. Do you know what I mean? He should be mad. Max Pop, he's got seven and a half thousand food, four thousand gold. Yeah, he should be slinging that food. Almost fifteen hundred stone in the bank. He, he should just be two hundred Pop, man, not 140, 150 all the time. Yeah, he should be slinging that food uh, as uh, as long as he won't really need any food at all. So he should be slinging it or at least selling it. I don't know. Uh, anyway, let's uh, keep a look at the fighting here between uh, Kyo. It looks like Kyo is helping now on the upper side of the map, leaving B-Virus pretty much alone down there. I hope that's gonna be still fine with B-Virus. He's not um, able to do any kind of major progress here. A lot, a lot of skirmishes there from um, from Hans as well. Not too many paladins. Is he hurting for gold or what is happening to Tammy? Yeah, he's hurting a lot for gold at this point. Um, this and you got B virus sat on four thousand gold. Yeah, yeah, that's uh, that's unfortunate. Um, uh, these rams are not gonna be able to do anything at all. I f uh, I'm afraid because there's the sars there. Um, not looking um, exceptionally well, the upper side here for the POZ team as well. I mean, they're well, not closing, no, 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 but they're no. not pushing. Uh, up, upper side will be fine, because you look, Hassan's completely out. Goku's out of the game with, with the Tribune, and Hassan is all on Hassan now. Hassan hasn't got a single Paladin or anything. Uh, can you switch between the players' point of views and tell me the gold? Is there any player who still has uh, any decent amount of gold here? Uh, this... No, no, but nobody apart from B virus. All so... the rest, some, some are below hundred. The max the, anyone else has got is five hundred, and B virus is still sat on two and a half thousand. Um, I wonder why are not uh, aren't they trading? Is this uh, is this hard to make a trade here? Because there could be a nice trade line actually from this, uh, from the bottom of Rob base to the top of um, Stark space, for example. Same thing for uh, uh, Tammy here and B virus. So I kind of wonder why no Marcus just up here. It looks like they're just doing this. Tammy just put two Marcus in there on the top of his base. Yeah, and there's blue, there's a Kyo market right at the bottom, but they're risking it because Goku is, is all at water. I so go Goku can Goku can take all of the markets out from the water. Yeah, the thing is, Goku's still in 60 population, man. I do wonder what is Goku doing as Boom is being so slow. He did or... nothing. Goku Goku didn't have anything left. Um, I don't even think he's got a TC. No, he's Goku, still doesn't... go. Goku just went, started chopping wood, getting gold, and all Goku's done then since is go mass water, which is annoying, POZ. Goku's probably done everything he could with what little he had left. He's full out on water, if you look. He's got galleys and he's got cannon galleons. Yeah, he has zero TCs, that's what Mem said, that's true. Goku still has no TC at all, and um, that's hard, man. That's hard like that, Goku. You need to start to try and do something. I don't know if stone is a problem. I don't know if there's no stone left in the map and they don't want to spend resources buying stone. That's probably one of the reasons, I'm not sure. I just wish B virus would smash every single wall that our rad has done down the bottom so he's not restricted. Stark is able to defend with like a third of the army that B virus has got. Because they just. 
he's just keeping himself restricted with all the walls. Yeah, Bivaris is uh, having a harsh fight here against the, the galleons of uh, Goku here. I'm not sure he should be taking that fight, actually. Um, but I, I totally agree with you. Before trying to push, he needs to clear all these walls as soon as he can. Uh, because there's now Goku with cannon galleons trying to destroy that castle from Bivaris. Uh, and what's there to stop him? Nothing at all. Yeah, you, it, it looks like ones that are actually going to finish this game is going to be Ding and... Um, the upper side, right? With skirmishers yeah, and plot ding, archers. <laughs> ding, ding and rats at the top. Because, with, yeah, with the virus allowed himself, allowed himself to get cramped in and, and it's such, so easy for them to defend. Stark has literally defended that whole area with maybe 20 manga dies, if that. Yeah, this could be a little bit dangerous now, though. Uh, Stark doing this very smartly, bringing in some Siege Onagers into the top of the, of the map. And what can skirmishes do against Siege Onagers? Pretty much nothing. So a few cavalry is required here. Um, looks like Rice trying to push here from the left side. Not sure how much of uh, an effectiveness will this have, uh, because there's walls all over. And a few galleons here from uh, Reds as well. Do you know one good thing? Do you know one really good thing? They, they, they've tell, carried... They, they've carried on where they left last week. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Playing awesome tight games yeah, all, yeah, yeah, yeah. all, awesome all game. over the map. All over the map. Anyone's going to win. Awesome game indeed. And it looks like um, KGB Bold Stark is doing the push here. Um, also not sure how uh, how good is this going for him. He doesn't have many Mango Dye left. I see like six or seven. That's all. And B-Virus with a very healthy amount of um, uh, Mango Dye right there. But still, he didn't clear these walls. He needs to clean these walls before he even thinks about a push. Be right back. Okay, sir. And uh, yeah, slowly but surely, it's uh, Ding here and uh, Kyo and Vikings Reds uh, trying to push here. Uh, I see not Hussars just yet, but probably soon enough they will have Hussars. Uh, Siege Honors here from Tsunami. Nice, nice choice. Um, yeah, they need the Plumed Archers are kind of misplaced. They need to go a little bit in front to make sure they can kill these Hussars because Skirms alone are not going to be able to tackle the job alone. There we go, the uh, plum Archers are there, they're gonna be able to clean these Hussars in no time. Uh, yeah, needs to move back with the Siege Onishers, make sure he keeps all of them alive, looks like he's doing a good job. I still see uh, two of them, yeah, 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 no, but only two of them are left now. Sorry about that, guys, uh, uh, that was one of my own taunts, I'm sorry about that. And uh, let me switch back to the bottom once more. Yeah, the, that castle is gone for B-Virus, there's only one left, but still a lot of Siege Onishers, um, but he's still Having, uh, having a very hard time here trying to push into um, into Ra's base. He's lost so, so much time here. And um, in my opinion, he should be just trying to clear these walls with these Siege Onagers. And then, once they are cleared, try to move in and try to do the decisive push. Anyway, this is uh, looking really good here at the top now for the POZ team. Siege Onagers there from B-Virus. There are a few light cavalry, probably soon to be a uh, Hussar. There's a lot of elite plumed archers from uh, Kyo also as well. They're only missing Siege, um, or well, they do have the Siege, but the Siege is not being used at this moment. And this could be bad, actually. Uh, these trebuchets are... Um, no, sorry, this is one of his allies, so these trebuchets are just fine. Uh, but both of them should be focusing that castle, not only one of them. Yeah, there goes the second this one could be able to do that too and uh yeah 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 looking better looking better hassan with a lot of lot of hussars here uh obviously full upgraded by now and uh, maybe a few help of years wouldn't be a bad idea here for uh kyo uh, yeah, that uh, Onisha shot was not bad from um, from the Stark there, but a lot of Hussars coming in now. Uh, these uh, Plumed Archers need to move in before these uh, Siege Onisha are going to be killed. Nope, there's no saving them. I think all the Siege Onisha are going to be killed. There he goes. Uh, but Hassan, keep in mind, he's going to lose probably all of these Hussars because... Oh my god, how many Plumed Archers does Kyo have? I will take a look at it very soon. This looks like, like 80 or even 90 Plumed Archers. Very, very nice job here by Kyo. Uh, taking a look at the south side, nothing's happening. Uh, no, nothing's happening right there. He's still be virus stalling his push onto a uh, Ra's base. Yeah, uh, they said they need C to try and push something here to be able to do anything funny. Um, not much army left. Not much army left there to defend this castle. Now it's the time for POZ team to actually move in with all of its army. A few more trebuchets could be needed there, I reckon. And um, yeah, just um, don't shoot this building. Shoot the castle first and be uh, sure you, you can push as fast as you can. 
Uh, there's a hole there, thought so it's good. I will switch very fast into Tammy's point of view. I mean, yeah, he's not doing his sorrow upgrade. He does not have the gold necessary to click the upgrade. So um, that's something a um, bit unfortunate to him. That's trouble, says uh, KGB. I wasn't watching, but I'm pretty sure he means what's coming from here. And uh, that's uh, Tammy who needs to be uh, very careful with his skirmishes. He's gonna let. Oh, yeah. A heavy shot there by KGB. Oh, a second one incoming. Not too many casualties, though. But yeah, totally unprotected. Why did Kyo go back with his army? Is something happening here in the back? Nope, it's not. I don't understand why Kyo just ran back with his army, leaving all these trebuchets undefended. Oh, in this shot. Oh, Jesus Christ. What? What a Smashing shot by uh, by Black Bolt there. That's a very 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 awesome shot there. And uh, Mem warning me, it's gonna be GG soon at Ras base. Um, he's uh, probably right. Right. Yeah, it's probably right. Still missing three trebuchets though. And welcome back, Mister. And uh, yeah, I was just gonna say they finally started to move towards Ras base, but. Uh, where the are the trebuchets, right? Where are the trebuchets? Yeah, and what is B-Virus doing? He's not... All those houses could be gone by now. There's not a single army there to stop him. Yeah, this this could be good now. This could be good now. There's a lot of um, light cavalry should have, now. Not a sword, but this could be good. As Mem said, he should have Ferraris as well. He's, he's Mongols. I mean, those Ferraris would have just smashed everything down so quick. Indeed, indeed. Uh, you, you do need to wonder why no siege ramps. And do keep in mind, the siege ram upgrade doesn't cost any gold at all. It's only 1,000 food. So uh, that's something he's not missing. At least he wasn't missing before. Let me go back into post tsunami. Yeah, uh, only 400 gold by now. Um, oh, they can go in now. They can go in. He could literally run into Ra's base. Yeah, he's probably just waiting until that castle is down. And to be extremely honest, ooh, a few siege yeah, monitors here coming from uh, uh, Black Wolf. Black Dink, on, Dink should run in. Dink could run in with all those light calves. Literally, Rad is open. Just literally run to the other side of Ra's base. Yeah. Throw all the attention somewhere else. Now they're not. This Move is the uh, up, please. This is looking a little bit bad here for Ra. Let's see if he is able to keep that castle. This castle is the only thing that's keeping uh, the POZ team from attack. And a uh, few light cavalry for B Virus himself now. Not uh, what is he doing? Yeah, he's trying to snipe the siege honors. This is actually a very nice idea. One is going to be gone. Uh, probably all of them. This is actually a very nice move here, Martin. Very sneaky. Very very nice job here by B Virus. He's going to be able to take all of these siege honors down. One of them is down already. Or easy. Or easy. Come on, man. Focus. Focus. Yeah, there you go. Two are down. Probably a third one. Ooh, that was a bad shot by Black Bolt, killing his own uh, Siege Honor shot there. I'm gonna switch a little bit back to the uh, to the north side, which is not looking too good for the POZ team now, Martin. Look at that. That's a um, few Hussars and... Oh yeah, but Ratz is there with a lot of Galleons. Uh, so it's probably they're gonna be fine. A few Hussars coming in, though. Yeah, they got lots of map, map to defend with at the top, though, haven't they? It's not as if what, Has what Hassan is running with is really going to kill off Ding's base. Like, yeah. Raz, Raz, Raz base is going to be in a whole world of trouble as soon as that castle goes down. Yeah, and look at the numbers of Plum Darches here for, by Kyo Martin. It's just unbelievable. Um, and just, man just told us it was 120 Plum Arches from Kyo. That's insane, man. That's just insane amount of army. And the castle will not will not resist too much, uh, too long, too much longer. Uh, probably one hit is going to be able to destroy it. There we go. Oh, nope, that it still stays up for a little bit longer. It's but gonna need it's this down, one probably. This yeah. one. Uh, maybe oh. not. No, no, no. Maybe not. Maybe nah, not. He, needs he, needs, to. he needs the other trap firing. Yeah, and yeah. It's not. He needs to. He needs to. He needs to. One of them is there. He just needs to unpack it. You're almost there, B virus. And once that castle is down, uh, that's gonna be really, really trouble for a Ras base right there. Well, I'm hoping once it's down, they run straight into the middle with all the Mangadai. But focus, because focus, B virus. That's, that's trade gone. That's Raz town gone. Yeah, yeah. That's the whole lot in one hit with those elite Mangadais. This is definitely in favor of. Uh, this is definitely in favor of PLZ team, and you will also see Raz saying it's over. Uh, that castle is gonna follow. Raz not even repairing it anymore. And uh, that's the GG, GG call. That's the GG call. What an amazing game we just saw here, guys. The PLZ team taking this to the four four. Absolutely incredible. Coming back from a 3-0 on this series, <coughs> making it 4-4, and we're gonna see Game 9. What an amazing oh, wow. game. What an amazing series, man. Uh, just unbelievable. Was... Unbelievable. And that was GG. Uh, let me make sure I won't miss the uh, statistics this time. Um, yeah, uh, Tammy... Uh, Tammy, that doesn't surprise me. 93 army, 93 largest army, 500 kills with a lot of paladins. He did, he did lose a lot of armies too, but um, mostly skirmishes probably. Um, 
Yeah, Goku was a bit of a black sheep here on the KGB team, Martin, right? Um, he unfortunately uh, wasn't... He was able to stalk a little bit the push at the down, down side of the map, but um, he didn't do all too much during this game, did he? Well, he didn't. No, you couldn't blame Goku. I think it was a sort of bad strategy, really. He was Vikings, he was flank, he was all on his own. Yeah, and, villager high 50. 50 yeah, villager and, they, high. and they planned for Goku to be the one slinging, which was always going to be a huge risk when Kyo went fast imp and Kyo built forward castle outside Goku's base. And then it allowed B Virus with Mongols to absolutely have a free boom. And thank you very much. I guess what's going to happen? Yeah, yeah. And yeah. On, KG, on KGB team, Stark had a really fast feudal. Assumed he was going to be equal or behind rats and w and tried to do the the landing instead of just going all out rush war. Anyway, so it was a bit, it was a little bit unlucky-ish, um, but but um, I think was he just played better, better strategy. Oh, even then, mind Hassan almost pulled it back with Ra at the top and Hassan landing in the middle and Goku's massive wall in to delay them. And I thought POZ took way too long to get into Goku's base and gave POZ and um, gave KGB a chance to come back, which what dragged the game on so long. Indeed. So no, I wouldn't blame, I wouldn't blame Goku at all. I think it was just bad choice of um, strategy in the position Goku was in. If, if Hassan had been right in front of Goku and maybe they totally walled up the top and Goku was there and Hassan burst forward through the walls, then yeah, maybe that would have been different, but they didn't. They allowed Goku to try and defend everything on his own with walls. Anyway, sir. What an awesome game, though. Game. What an excellent game, man. What an excellent game that was, man. Excellent game.